We'll start by creating a new mobile app with C++ and we'll do a header footer. Okay, we'll add a couple of controls. We'll add two buttons. We'll add an image and we'll add an action list. Okay, so now let's get these things set up here inside the environment. We're going to make this fit the client and we're going to align them to the left and the right. And we're also going to change them to look like a camera there and we'll make it look like a share sheet here. Okay, now all we need to do is add a little code to create an action on this one. And we'll make a media library action called photo from camera. And in that action event called did finish taken, we're going to assign a bitmap. And we'll assign it the passed in bitmap or image. Okay. And then secondly, we'll do the same thing with this here. We're going to create a new action. We'll call this one share sheet. And in this, before execute, we are going to again assign the bitmap. And we're ready to go. That was it. Let's go ahead and build and deploy to my plugin Android device. Now it's installing and ready to run. Okay, now we can see the app running on my device. I'm going to go ahead and click the button to start the camera. And then we're looking at my desktop. Let's take a snapshot. We'll save that. And now let's share it. Then I'll go ahead and share this on my Twitter account. Okay, let's go back to our same project. You can see the same source code in there and same design. And what we're going to do is we're going to take this exact same app and source code and build it for iOS. First thing we can do is we can see what it's going to look like right here in the designer. Let me pick an iPhone 5 and we get the, uh, the platform look and feel for the iOS 7. We can also look at iOS 6. And at this point, basically, we just need to plug in our target. So let me plug in my device here and we'll go ahead and look for it. and there it is. So I'm going to go ahead and now take this exact same source code, rebuild it, and deploy it to my iOS device. This time, rather than building an SO that lives inside of an APK, I'm building a dot .app that lives inside of an IPA. And This will all get uh, built, packaged, and signed and deployed to my device for me. Okay, let's take a look at that iOS app running on the device. There it is in Reflector, okay. And now what we're going to do is go ahead and run that application. We see the camera there. Ooh, wow, that is cool. Let's take a picture. Okay, let's use that photo. And let's go ahead and send that to my Twitter feed. There we go.